Um, now to jump over to Tom's question about the parallel compression on her vocal. Now that's where we stay in the DLive for this. This is a pretty slick feature of the DLive. Uh, one of my favorite attributes of this desk. Um, and I, I, you know, wish more desks did this. Um, but one of the things like I, I mentioned, uh, here's my, if you look at this, we're on our show level, right? And then this is my input channel. And that input channel feeds this guy right here, which is my group, which is up. All right, we'll take it down. And now, like I said, the input channel is for dynamics. So the parallel compression happens on the input channel and those are linked between the Billy main and the Billy spare. So that way, if you like change it a parameter, for instance, let's show you what I got the, it's crazy. Now, I always preface by saying, be careful, this is a very dangerous thing. I do it because, well, sometimes extreme situations cause calls for extreme measures where you have to bring up a lot of more information during the quiet parts and try to really limit the louder parts. And you can only do so much without completely destroying something. So as you can see on Billy vocal, on the Billy actual input channel is where at the end, after all that compression that I'm doing in waves, it feeds into the channel strip into this insert point and then it feeds this compressor. Now this compressor is all buttons in. Fantastic, I love it. Um, but keep in mind this is a risky thing, so tread lightly. But this also you have to note that the parallel path is what I'm utilizing in order to keep this clean. Now I'm already kind of doing some busing in this session from last year, a little bit more elaborate uh, busing in order to keep the phase aligned. It felt like it was a pretty easy, quick way to add parallel compression. And I kind of was working on this last year and I kind of felt like I got it somewhere where I liked it. Now this parallel path is fantastic. Uh, it's available on all of the inputs and, and outputs on the deep processing. It's uh, a fantastic option to literally destroy a part of your s signal chain and just like tuck it under. Uh, definitely give it, gets it, give it some, you know, some fun time because you guys really should focus on on playing around with it. It's pretty slick. Uh, one of the biggest things I love about this desk. Um, uh, so that takes care of the parallel compression. Mm -hmm.